My name is Amina Abdullahi and I'm from Brook High School and, and my poem is called Dear Terrace. Dear Terrace, I'm tired. I'm tired of people hearing Islam and assuming terrorism, Muslim and assuming terrorist. I'm tired of feeling guilty on the anniversary of 9-11, your celebration. Every year I dread this day. Two or three pairs of eyes shooting laser beams through my hijab. A shield I use to protect myself from their judgments and questions. As if people didn't stare at me enough every day. Expressions mixed with resentment dancing all over my classmates' faces. Your people did this. They think I am proud of the actions of a few individuals who've lost their way but still claim to be a Muslim. Pictures of 9-11 flying up on the smart board. Jumpers frozen in time. 30 pairs of eyes condemning me to a person I'm not. The voice of the teacher fades. That then anger, misunderstandings, and helplessness boils up my blood like a volcano ready to explode. I want to yell, Muslims are not terrorists, and terrorists are not Muslims. Representing 15 million Muslim voices around the world, but I don't want to I don't want people judging me. Islam can be judged based on murderers. Murderers who have fallen so far from the glorious tree of Islam that they have become shelter for the insects and food for the decomposers. Islamophobes created Islamophobia and terrorists enforced it. Little Muslim kids can't even play with paper airplanes because now it's considered terrorist training. 9-11-2001, nearly 3,000 people died. Two planes swooping down like vultures who spotted their prey. With the first encounter, the worst is still. History repeating, Boston Marathon. Two bombs, three people dead, 264 injured. Runners went from competing in a marathon to limping in amputations for the rest of their lives. And you call yourself a Muslim. History repeating, Charlie Edbo, news headline, comic newspaper shooting, 12 dead. You've added, to the rivers of, you've added to the rivers of tears of all the injustice happening in this world. And you call yourself a Muslim. Muslims are prohibited to take their own lives, let alone take others. How many people Islam told you to kill? Zero.